That's why you can say what you want to say about my boy Ryan, okay? Ryan steps up. Don't tell me that Ryan jumped off the porch before you, bro. Don't tell me that. But then again, a lot of people knock Ryan. One of the main things I like about Ryan, he seen he got that Adrian Broner mentality. It seems to be he'll get in there with anybody. If the money's right, he's not holding it up. He ain't trying to protect his own. He ain't hide behind being a, being a pretty boy or none of that stuff. And he could do all that. So once again, man, shouts out to Ryan, man. You know what I'm saying? Shouts out to Ryan. The kid try to stay in the mix. It's the intent that people need to look at. It's the intent. But don't tell me Ryan jumped off the porch before you tank. Eddie wants to pay him over 20 mil. The Saudis got the money. That's not the question. The money is there. The money is not the question. The question is, is you going to step up? If not, this train can go on without him. I have no problem with Tank continue to doing what he's doing. You know what I'm saying? I've been lost my expectation to see him do anything of any note. Like I said, the same thing with Canelo. I, I let them dudes do what they want. You know what I'm saying? The show can go on. I care about the movers and the shakers. But this right here, it ain't a good look, man. Once again, it is not a good look. But I'm concerned that Team Davis, they not concerned with looks and stuff. I get it. It's strictly just the money. I get it. But damn, like... It ain't none of your ego wrapped up in this. Like, you don't feel a little, some kind of way. Uh, I mean, you ain't got to. As long as you get your paper, you can take care of your family. Um, You know what I'm saying? You reached the goal as far as I'm concerned. But how you going to be remembered? I don't know, man. That should. It should move you. It might not. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I ain't forced nobody to do nothing. I'm just saying, I, I know what I'm saying. And I recognize the people who get out here and try to make these fights happen and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? That's why you got to give props to Haney, Garcia, um, uh, Joshua, uh, Crawford, uh, Uzik, uh, Anui, uh, just anybody who's just trying to make something get popping. You know, David Benavidez, anybody who's trying to get it popping. That's who I'm with and that's who I'm behind. But, uh, man... Ryan Garcia better not get in the fight with uh, Haney before you tank, man. You know what I'm saying? Because it's getting to the point where I was going to say for the longest, like, you can keep skating on this. But one thing I like about what Devin Haney did, he cut y'all train short. He cut y'all train short. Okay? He brought the flashlights in. They were like, hey, 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 man, what's going on? What are we doing here? What's what, 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 what? Like I said, the accomplishments will catch up to the clout. And they're going to want to see the so-called big, the flashy dude get in there with the so-called dude who's actually making stuff happen. You can't escape Devin at this point. The only thing you can do is duck him, just like you did Lomo, whatever and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But like I said in my previous videos, it's a penalty to building your career like this. It's a real penalty. Because like I said, all it's going to take for one loss for Tank to be no good because of the way he's built. That's all it's going to take is one loss for him to be no good. I don't know. Tell me what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. Bruce Vane, I'm out.